couldn't help but think Amen. of the passage Amen. of the Amen. Apostle Paul when he came to the Corinthian church and he said, my, uh, my speech and my preaching was not with enticing words of man's wisdom, but in demonstration of the spirit and of the power. We speak the wisdom of God in a mystery, even the hidden wisdom, which God ordained before the world into, uh, unto our glory. He said, uh, for Christ sent me not to baptize, but to speak, to preach the gospel not with wisdom of words, lest the cross of Christ should be made of none effect. For the preaching of the cross is to them that perish foolishness, but the preaching of the cross to them that perish is foolishness. But unto us which are saved, it is the power of God. But if our gospel be hid, it is hid to them that are lost, Amen. in whom the God of this world hath blinded the minds of them Amen. which believe not, yeah. lest the light of the glorious gospel of Christ, who is the image of God, should shine unto them. Amen. For we preach not ourselves, but Christ Amen. Jesus the Lord and ourselves, your servant for Christ's sake. For God who commanded the light to shine out of darkness, yes. God who commanded the light yes. to shine out of darkness hath shined in our hearts to give the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of uh, Jesus Christ. Amen. But we have this treasure yes. in oh earthen God. vessels right. that the excellency of the power may be of God That's and it. not of us.
his love tonight. Yes. Amen. Yes. There is a lot of people out there tonight saying that God isn't real. Come on. Show me God. Come on. I don't believe in God. That's what they're saying. He doesn't exist. That's what they Come on. They spew hate. Yes, they do. That's what they say. <laughs> Is love. Oh, yes. They sow discord. Yes. When God wants people to come together come on. and love one another. Amen. They sow confusion. Come on. When it's God that brings the peace of mind. Amen. I've been a witness to that. Yes, you have. Come on. I've had the love of God to come into my heart. Yes, you have. I've had the blood of Jesus Christ applied to my heart. Yes. One day I was a sinner. Thank you, Lord. One day I was out in that world. Yes, you were. Living an ungodly life. Heading to a pathway of destruction. Yes, you were. But one day at an altar. I gave my heart to Jesus Christ. And his love. Come on, Joe. Where hate. Somebody give him a praise. And confusion. And discord. And sadness. And disappointment. Now dwell love. Hope. Come on. Excitement. Encouragement for my future. Give him one. Thank you. And I've never been the same tonight. Jesus is still the answer today. I want to shout it from the rooftop tonight. Jesus is still the answer tonight. He's still the answer tonight for your soul. And your soul. If you need him here tonight. If you feel that. There's just something missing in my heart. It's the love of God. Amen. It's the love of God. Amen. It is His peace. Yes. It is His contentment. If you need Him tonight, I encourage you to come to the altar and give your heart to God. Because Jesus is still the answer tonight. Don't you believe it? Amen. Yeah. 
this is the time to come. Yes. We ministered. The service was what God gave us. But has it been effective enough? That if one sinner is in agony of the soul tonight, you can come. Whether you're a woman, man, young, older, just leave your chair. And by open surrender and open confession, you come as Jesus was upon the cross openly. So he bids you come. And you be on the crossroad of your life and say, I'm going to give my life to Jesus the rest of my life. I'm committing it tonight. I want to be saved. If you're not saved from your past sin. And if you just need Jesus to help you, come and let him help you. I hope there is one, there is another. But the altar is open. And Christ is the altar. And you come. We can't save you. He can. We can't change your life. He can. Amen. Yes. Some churches invite people to come and join the church. We never do that. We should invite you to come. By Jesus Christ. As Lord and Master. Confess your sins. Leave him with your whole heart. Confess him before men. And you will be saved. And then you can receive the added blessing sanctification of the Holy Spirit yes. and the Holy Spirit in your life. Yeah. Brother Troy, would you sing that chorus again? You that know it, you see it on the screen. Sing it with you. I'm going to pray with Brother Jordan. But if there's anyone else that needs Jesus, just come and stand with us right now. And Jesus will touch you. Come here, man. Jesus is still the answer.
Lord to come and let him fill your life. There's someone here, I know they're here, and I know that one night they're going to make the break, and they're going to come just like this young man. We love this young man. He's been here before. This is not his first time. He can come and be a part of us. We love him. He can be here tomorrow at the 2 o'clock service. We love him. Praise our God. We love you. We love you. I want prayer sisters up here from now on. When we give an altar call, I want some prayer warriors to come and stand here. Some women of the church. Praise the name of the Lord. Because we're going to be bidding sinners come. Sometimes our sisters are more comfortable to come and pray with sisters. Don't you think we need sisters here? Praise the name of the Lord. We're inviting sisters to come. We're inviting brothers to come. This is the house of God. There's no respect of persons here. We believe that God loves you. There is no race here. There is no color here. There is no prejudice here. We are people that love you and love God. Praise the name of the Lord. Brother, would you sing it one more time, brother? Would you sing it one more time? Praise God. Jesus is still the answer. Sing that chorus over there. Praise God. Look at it on the screen. Lift her hands while we're singing and worship him. and laid it down Percocet 
and said, God can heal me. God can take my pain. How many believe that God will hear that woman? And believe God for her tonight. I want you to lift your hand with me and say, I believe that Jesus Christ was Lord yesterday. And he is Lord today. And he will be Lord tomorrow. And he will be. And he is my King of kings. My returning Savior. And I am ready to affect men's lives for Jesus Christ in a dark world. A living Christ. A living Christ. For a dying world. Praise the name of the Lord. 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 Turn to your neighbor and say, praise God. And remember the Harris family tonight. And Brother Benjamin, I'll be out there doing 